you are looking for the vital must-have items that you need to be able to get in shape and really lose fat, that's what we're going to talk about today. What's up, everybody? Hope hope you guys are all doing really good out there. Today we're on our quick uh, tip Tuesday. We're going to talk about the must-haves to help you get in the best shape of your life, to lose weight, gain muscle, really no matter what um, phase of diet you're in or workout program, whatever it is, there's some things that you have to have to make sure that you're going to have success in whatever endeavor you're trying to get out to. So if you want to make sure that you're getting success, there are absolute things that you have to track. No matter what stage of your diet or meal plan or anything like that, there's certain things that you just have to keep track of. Number one, at least some sort of way to track calories. Now, with our meal plans, oftentimes at the beginning stages, we don't have you track calories, but we do have you track protein. And really protein you is a must. No matter where you're at, you have to make sure that you're getting the correct amount of protein in your diet on a daily basis. To be able to do this, you need to know first off the calculation on how, me- how much protein and how much calories you should be taking in on an everyday basis. To do that, you're gonna need some sort of, of tracking tool. So we have our own app that allows you to track your protein, all of your food that you take in during the day. You can also get calculations on what you're supposed to be getting in for that day. So something to be able to track on a daily basis, meal by meal, what you're taking in. The second thing, and really to me, is a really important thing. I've recently just started utilizing it and have noticed the significance that it can really help in in people's lives is that of a, a food scale. Making sure that you're completely accurate in the nutrients that you're taking in. I have come to find out I was wildly either overestimating or underestimating the amount of food I was taking in. If a serving size says it's um, two tablespoons or a certain amount of grams, you have to make sure that that's the amount you're taking in, especially for things like, you know, you you look at something like peanut butter, it's 190 grams per serving, which is only two tablespoons. I can almost promise you you're taking in more than just two tablespoons, but that's where a food scale can come in handy. You can zero it out you know there's a million different brands out there how you the one you use it really doesn't matter um they they make ones that connect to different fitness apps help you to to track your your nutrients throughout the day that's great but really just something to be able to guarantee that the amount of calories you're putting into your body you're taking account for it's really really simple to be two to five hundred calories over what you think you're taking in if you're not accurately measuring. Now you can do that other ways besides a food scale, but that's the way that I have found it to be best. The the most accurate way that I know for sure this is the amount of a protein or, or calories that I'm putting into my body. So again, we don't really like the word diet around here. We We don't think that you necessarily have to go without things or put yourself on some crazy diet but in every program every successful program that you're going to find out there you have to track what's going into your body it's just how you're going to find success so guys i hope you found this uh this quick tip really helpful hopefully you can um, start implementing that right away into your daily routine Uh, if you want the link for our fitness app which helps you to track your uh, your nutrients your meals every single day also there's free workouts that are built into the app um, if you'd like to access those as well so there's a link down at the bottom there down in the description that'll help you to uh, download the app completely free help make sure that you're on the right track to getting success. Also, go ahead and check out the uh, description. I'll I'll put a few of them down there, different food scales that can help you maintain that accuracy when you're keeping track of what's going into your body. 
I hope everybody enjoyed this. If you liked the video, hit the thumbs up. Go ahead, subscribe, hit that bell notification. I will see you guys next time.